Good morning! I am Teacher Kat. Welcome to another lesson. Today, we are going to have a new lesson, which is identifying percentage, base, and rate in a problem. Now, are you ready to find out? Let's start this lesson with an equation. Here is the equation. 20% of 80 is 16. In this given equation, 20% is the rate. Why? Because rate is also called percent, which has percent symbol, while 80 is the base. The base is the original amount and usually comes after the word of. 16 is the percentage. Why? Because percentage is part of the original amount and found usually before the word is. Let's have another equation. Let us identify the percentage, base, and rate. Here is the equation. 10 is 50% of N. 10 here is our percentage because it comes before the word is. 50% is our rate because the number has percent symbol. And N is our base because it comes after the word of. And remember, N here means that we don't know yet the base. Our base is unknown in this equation. This time, I want you to answer the following activities. Let's have activity number one. All you have to do is to identify the percentage, base, and rate in this equation. 10 is 25% of N. I will give you 5 seconds to answer. Congratulations! 10 is our percentage, N is our base, and remember, N is unknown in this equation and needs to be solved. And our rate is 25%. Let's have the second equation. 49 is N percent of 70. So, 49 is our percentage. N percent is our rate. 70 is our base. Did you get the same answer? Well, excellent! Let's have activity number 2. All you have to do is identify what is the missing term. Choose percentage, base, or rate. Here is the equation. 20% of N is 16. I will give you 5 seconds to answer. Good job! The missing term in this equation is base. Since you already know how to identify percentage, base, and rate in a problem, I have here questions. Number one, what do you call the number with percent symbol? Very good. The answer is rate. Number two, what do you call the original amount and usually comes after the word of? Yes, correct. The answer is base. Number three, what do you call the part of the original amount and found usually before the word is? Very good. The answer is percentage.
Comment down your answers below and I will check it after. This is Teacher Kat saying thank you and God bless.